And when we talk about businesses hurt during the pandemic, we're often thinking about restaurants or retail, but recreational facilities, places like um, Golden Fleece Billiards or bowling alleys really had a hard time during the pandemic. They didn't have the option to do curbside pickup. They didn't have the option to do takeout uh, food like that because they're selling an experience, not a product. And that limited their ability to stay open um, while capacity has been capped. Now, Golden Fleece Billiards was completely shut down for a full year and many bowling alleys were in the same boat. Phase three helped them open to 50% capacity, but phase two means going back to 25% capacity. The business owners I talked with said they were just starting to feel like they were getting their footing again and hired back employees. Now they might have to let them go again. And we have to let them go again and close down again. I don't know how we're going to survive, you know, because I have a double bill for the building and taxes and everything and for business. But we're so grateful to see this, this big outpouring. And then the next week we have to roll back to 25% or to zero. Uh, what are those poor employees doing? Now, just a reminder, as part of these metrics, counties have to meet two metrics, and one is the number of COVID-19 cases, the other is the number of hospitalizations, and so far here in western Washington, six counties are not meeting those metrics. The governor is set to announce which ones will be rolling back at 11 a.m. We'll have coverage of that coming up and live coverage on our website as well. For now, live in Everett, Kayla Lafferty, King 5 News.